Let's bring in Republican Senator from Wyoming, John Barrasso. He is a member of the Senate Foreign Relations Committee. Sir, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Melissa. Um, so what do you think this means for President Trump's foreign policy? Well, I think it's good that we now have a secretary of state on the job. Mike Pompeo is the right person to do it. He has the intelligence and the integrity, the experience uh, to do it. I'm glad to see him confirmed 57 to 42. And in terms of the foreign policy, the world remains a very dangerous place, Melissa. And you see it in Iran. You see it in North Korea. You see it with Russia, other hot spots around the world, what we're seeing in Syria. It's good to have Mike Pompeo there and now on the job. One of the things at the top of his list has to do with the Iran nuclear deal. Do you think that uh, Secretary Pompeo will encourage the president to pull out of that deal? Or make it stronger. Look, what we have, Iran, with a nuclear weapon is going to make the world less safe, less secure, less stable. We cannot allow that to happen, but the current Iran deal allows Iran to have a path to a weapon. We know there have already been bad actors. They're developing ballistic missiles. They're using money that the Obama administration gave them as part of the Iran deal. They're using that money for terrorism. They're providing weapons in Syria. I think Iran cannot be trusted under any circumstances. And to have Mike Pompeo on the job is important to work along with President Trump to make sure that we make sure Iran never gets a nuclear weapon. What did you learn about him during the hearings um, that you think will shape the way that he manages the State Department? And, and not just in the hearings, Melissa. I've traveled with Mike Pompeo to international security conferences. He knows the people. He knows the issues. He's been trained through the military as a graduate of West Point, so he knows the role that military plays, but he's also a Harvard-educated lawyer, member of the law review there, so he knows the rule of law and the importance of doing that. So he's the right person in terms of diplomacy, but we all know if we want safety and security at home, you need to have peace and stability around the world, so Mike Pompeo is the right person to carry that message. All right. Um, so now going forward, what do you see changing, um, you know, versus the outlook on our policy right away? What changes do you think will come in North Korea versus if we didn't have Mike Pompeo at the helm? Yeah, well, I think certainly with regard to Mike Pompeo, the relationship has started. He's been to North Korea, met with the leader there. Mike Pompeo is one that can make it very clear, as can President Trump, that we will not tolerate North Korea with a nuclear yeah. weapon. We know they've been doing testing of both the weapons as well as the missiles, and we need to make sure that the whole Korean peninsula does not have nuclear okay. weapons, period. Senator John Barrasso, thank you so much for joining us. We have Thanks. some breaking news that we want to get Thanks, to Melissa. right now. Appreciate it.